Hello guys, welcome back to Popori Masters channel. Now I'm going to be talking about some of our Nigerian people who are gogging in different cities of Italy. Um, there is one um, in the city of uh, Napoli. I don't know where this uh, our sister here, um, Adanambra, uh, met this one. Maybe in um, Torino. Um, I've been to Torino and I met uh, one of our Nigerian uh, brother who was not feeling fine. So a lot of people in different parts of Italy are not doing well. Honestly, they are really, really passing through a lot. Okay, they are really, really passing through a lot. A lot of them has gone mental. And you know, here there's no papa, there's no mama, there's no family members, you know, who can rally around to take care of you. So most of the times when our people goes mental, um, you realize that that will be the end of it. The person will just waste away because you don't have brother, especially when you are alone. You know this journey of crossing the Mediterranean Sea to Europe is always a thing of uh, singularity. And most times, except you have even a girlfriend or wife. Sometimes too, having a girlfriend or wife will not even save you. Once you go Kolomenta, most of the girls in Europe and all that are not after your <laughs> your 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 bad side when you when you go when you when you need help. They might just discard you immediately, carry their baby because in Europe, whether you carry father or you don't carry father, it doesn't really matter. Some women are the ones even chasing their husbands away. Okay? So this guy now is in the street. And um, he said he comes from Edo State. So if I do people, I beg Muna share this video. So let's see if we can get across to the family and um, see what they can do. Uh, the handle of this uh, particular woman who interviewed this guy is Adha Anambara. In case the family uh, knows him, he's from Edo State. I don't know whether he's Asia. Uh, I don't know which part of it uh, that he comes from. But you are going to listen to him. So if people can share, should share this video, it gets to the family and the family will intervene. Uh, in, in, in cases like this, what needs to be done is to bring this man home and, you know, balance his equation. Sometimes frustration, somebody will stay in the, in the country for many years without document, without any paper, without any support and all that. At the end of the day, maybe when they think too much, overthinking can even cause mental problems. You know, when they think too much and um, the thing enters their brain, they start misbehaving. They say that he's sleeping outside. He doesn't even have anywhere to sleep. So the, the situation is getting worse by the day. When you sleep in the cold and then you sleep, when this heat comes, you don't even have anything to cool you down. You, if you are mental or a little, a little. Then when these things happen to you, they turn your brain the more. So I want you people to watch this video and um, hear from this our sister when she interacted with this very guy in uh, Italy. Now watch. We don't need you. We don't need you. We don't need you. We don't need you. We you don't see. Why are they asking? You know, every time I they give you, money, you know me now. Every time I they give you, money, I they buy something. Because maybe your people go they look for you. And they don't know uh, this kind of thing that happened to you. You know? Uh, the name of your, uh, uh, your soul name? Osai. Osai, Osai, which side the problem? Which part of the problem? Or say me? Which part of the problem? Okada. Okay, it's from Okada. Or say me? I beg you, you need people. See your brother here. He lives in Italy. I'm always there give him something. He just see me now. He come make I give him small money. So I will still give him money. Make him use my son. So, he say he be Okada people. He said Okada. Eh? Mention the name of the, your... Okada. Okada. Okay. He said I name na Osai. Osai. Mm, Osas. Osas. Osas who? Osai. 
Who can say say or say or say me? So please, if you know the family, make it happen. I share this with you. Very family situation. So. Okay. So um, I believe you guys heard. I believe you guys heard uh, the woman when she was uh, saying that uh, this guy is from a uh, dusty. Uh, what do you call it? Um, or is it a uh, where do you call? It? Is it Okada? I mean, where? Where did they call himself? I don't even forget. So um, our people from a dusty to do but also oh yeah. This, there are many people gogging in these cities like Napoli. When it comes to Napoli, when it comes to uh, uh, what do you call it, Torino, Bologna, man, in fact, every place, every place you are going to get our people rusting away and rotting away because there is no help. So these people need serious attention, and our people should rise to the occasion of. I don't know whether we really truly have. Nigerian Association, we don't really have all these things because if we do, once things like this happens, the Nigerian Association is supposed to have branches in different states, especially those states because we have a lot of Edo people in Italy. So when it happens, this family in, in Europe here, this uh, Nigerian community in Europe here, can contact the one in, in Nigeria and say, okay, we'll make research, ask questions about the family of this very person. Then they prevent, they present that case to the family at home and say, look at your son, look at his uh, present predicament, look at his condition, what do you want us to do? How can we come in? How can we help? But there is none, there is none of such in Italy, in Europe. So how do you think that these problems will come to an end? Because there's no, there's, there's no connection. Everything is just jaga jaga. Very, very sad indeed. Um, let me know your opinion on this matter. I, I'm going to be leaving it here. The matter you get as it be, you look at the hair. Now, that means he has not been barbing his hair. The guy we met last time um, with uh, one of my friends in uh, uh, um, Torino there. I don't know his situation now. That one, we took him to the barbing saloon. He refused to barb his, his hair. So these people have, have gone really, really crazy. And it is something else. So I beg, help me share this video so it can get to the family. And uh, let's see how they can rescue him before, before he, gets, he, he, he gets to the, to the extreme where he cannot be repaired. At least now he's repairable before he becomes irreparable. Thank you and God bless you. Bye-bye.